You know, you wonder if some agents with clients headed to the NFL draft who've been to the combine tell their clients, stay away from the women if you don't have a girlfriend until after you get drafted. That message did not get to Sean Oakman's agent, and it sure as hell didn't get to Sean Oakman. Because I don't care if Sean Oakman emerges from this without a scratch, unless he has some sort of extraordinary reason, or this comes out to be entirely false. If it's entirely false, what I'm about to say will not happen. But Sean Oakman is all but out of the draft. Yeah. He's eligible. He's going to be looked at. Someone may go way down the lower rounds and take him. Maybe someone will take him higher than third round. Maybe, but I doubt it. He's going to drop. He's going to drop like a rock. Let's look at the situation. Sean Oakman met a woman, don't know her name, at a place called Scray McGruffy's in Texas. And... She invited him back to her place. That's what the police report says. But reportedly, once he got into the home, according to her, Oakman forced her into the bathroom and sexually assaulted her. His earring was off and all of this. The overall situation for her was such that she felt compelled to go to the emergency room. That's the big problem. You can't take away the fact that she went to the emergency room. You can't take that away. Oakman says he thought the sex was consensual, which means we have two problems. First of all, she went to the emergency room immediately. This is not anywhere like Jameis Winston where the where Erica Kinsman didn't head to the emergency room and in fact told Tallahassee police that she didn't want to cooperate with the investigation at the time. Something that a lot of people don't mention, right? And that's why Winston has been found not guilty several times. I mean, how many times do you have to do this sort of thing? But I digress. Getting back to Sean Oakman. Sean Oakman went home with this woman, admitted to having contact with her. He says consensual sex. She says entirely otherwise. But from the perspective of the National Football League, the question any team is going to wonder is, why in the hell were you so stupid as to do that just weeks before the NFL draft, man? Where is your head? And so if he does this now, the concern of any team is going to be, what's he going to do when we give him some money? Because he's already on the cusp to get money, and he does this. He gets himself into the situation. It's not whether or not it was true. But you got three basic things. First of all, he went home with this lady. Second of all, he admitted sex. Third, she went to the emergency room. Those are facts, even by his own admission. It would be a different thing entirely if Oakman, Oakman, Oakman had said, I never saw this woman in my entire life. He didn't say that. Toasted, man.